Hello, I'm Ralph, and I'm here to do a review for D6 Mafia of kittens in a blender. Yeah, I'm gonna do this game right here. That's it. Okay, here we go. Roll the thing. In Kittens in a Blender, the object of the game is to get as many of your kittens into the box as possible. That's the box. And as many of your opponent's cards, kittens, into the blender, which is right there. Yeah. So, at the end of the game, for each kitten in the box, you get two points. For each kitten in the blender, you get negative one points. So, you do the math. Now, to start the game, each player is going to pick a color of kitten to represent them. So we have the colors right here, yellow, blue, green, and pink. Now, any colors not used are set aside, and the rest are all shuffled into the deck. Now, to start the game, each player is going to draw a hand of six cards. At the end of each of your turns, you will always draw up to six cards. So. Now, uh, obviously, we have the kitten cards here, and the other types of cards are kitten movement cards. So you can move your kitten around the board. The board consists of three spaces. The blender in the box, which we talked about before, but there is also the counter. So kittens can be in the box, on the counter, or in the blender. Yes. So, kitten cards move kittens around the board. Can put all kittens in the blender or in the box. And then lastly, we have the dreaded blend card. Yes. So, the blend card is how you score kittens. Once it is played, all kittens in the box are removed from play and are safe. And all kittens in the blender are mm, uh, blended. So, uh, the game continues until all 16 blend cards have been played, and at which point the game is over. Doesn't matter if the deck runs out. Just keep playing until the blender burns out. No, oh, and that's pretty much the whole game. So, uh, yeah, that's it. Done. What do I think? Oh, what do I think? Oh, it's a, uh, oh, well, as you can see, it's a very simple game. I explained the whole thing just now. I'm sure you get it. And uh, it's easy to set up. It's uh, pretty easy to learn. Uh, any stupid idiot can learn it. Bring over your stupid friends. Finally, you can invite them because they all understand this game. So um, I would recommend this game for people who need easy games and uh, people who don't like crazy difficult things like uh, wizards and deities with ancient Egyptian things, technical tactic things, none of that. This is easy. So bust it out at a party with your friends. You can fight people over. Oh, oh, very, very important. They need to have a good, dark sense of humor. Can't be like, hey Jill, you wanna come over and uh, blend some kittens? No, all right, all right, see next time maybe? Okay, okay. No, so make sure they have a dark sense of humor cause yeah, you're, uh, you're blending kittens and a blender. That's not normally what it's used for. So I understand. Anyway, um, yeah, so that about wraps it up. Uh, I'm Ralph with K6 Mafia. Thank you for watching. Yay! That was good, right?